Hello there ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Paladins, which is Hyrus Studios new upcoming game uh, which is a team based PvP uh, kind of capture the point and push a uh, siege tank towards the enemy base to destroy their gates and then you know, destroy their vault um, type ish. Uh, so this is just uh, you know we're gonna take a look at the game, uh, how it plays, go over some uh, you know mechanics and stuff like that. I actually already tried to do this, but something was messed up with my the X-ray settings, so no sound was recorded, which was very annoying. <coughs> so yeah, uh, anyhow, um, so uh, what I would like to do is actually go over the characters, the paladins, I guess. You wanna, you know, call them that. I guess that's what they are. Uh, but there is actually no way to do that at all without actually going into the game and playing one. Um, so you are gonna go in blind if you don't, you know, of course, read up on the internet. But you know, me personally, when making this video, I would like to go over the each character and see what they can do, how their abilities do, and you know, what kind of class and you know. The Playstyle and stuff like that. But sadly I cannot do that. No. Um, but uh, whatever. Um, I guess we've been, you know. It's kind of, it's kind of weird. They already have a store in the game and it's closed beta. But, you know, they don't have a character overview tab. You know, it's just, just kind of, you know, priorities. Come on. You know. Let me learn the game before I start buying shit. Uh, but whatever. I actually did buy this Founders Pack um, to to you know get the chests and do a little opening to you know get some new cards and you know and, and have something you know more for the video. But since I already opened them in the other video, I actually don't you know I don't have any more chests to open. I don't want to spend another you know one exactly. I don't think I, can, I guess we can buy this, but I don't have enough. That that for one chest, Jesus Christ, dude. Alright, you do get chests by leveling up too, so we might get some after this that we can uh, unbox. Uh, but basics, you know, it's a PvP game um, by Hyrus, um, which you know you should know about if you watch my channel. They've made Smite, uh, which I'm a huge fan of, obviously. And uh, yeah. This is actually a pretty fun game. It's an FPS with kind of a twist. Um, it's, you know, Captain Point and Push Siege. Uh, but it also kind of plays like a MOBA in that you do have your, you know, let's say, you know, auto attack kind of. Um, your just basic attack, your, your left click shoot. Uh, but you also have your 1, 2, and 3 abilities. There might become, uh, come out an ultimate. That's, I don't think they have that in the, uh, they don't have that in the game yet. But I saw something on Reddit that they might start testing ultimates uh, to see, I guess, if that is going to make it into the game or not. But as of now, I think they, it kind of it feels very smooth and it's a uh, pretty well put together game so far for being a close beta. Um, but anywho, so every character has a 1, 2, and 3 uh, ability. And uh, yeah, so that's kind of like a MOBA 2, you know, just uh, pretty nice. But what also sets this game apart from other FPSs is how leveling up works. Because uh, you have these cards. So you can see the uh, characters that are actually in the game and you, you can't you can't see, you know, going to Gronk. Here you can see all the cards I have or the cards you can get for him. Um, but you can't actually see what his abilities do or what kind of character he is. I think he's got some kind of support. I haven't played him myself. Um, I've played Sky, uh, which is kind of the assassinish uh, type. Uh, she's very fun. One of my favorites uh, as of right now. Uh, Fernando, which is kind of a tankish um, damage dealer, frontliner. He has a flamethrower and a shield that is pretty huge. Buck, which is just boring as fuck to play. He is. He's really boring to play, in my opinion. 
Uh, but these are the three dudes that I've played or paladins. Um, but yeah, let's go into Sky and take a look at her cards. So leveling up works in the sense that when you gain a level, you get to choose from three different cards, random cards. Uh, so let's say like DK, uh, collaborate, co 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 collateral, I mean, and cloak appears when you press, I think it's you. Um, you level up, you press you, and uh, these three cards pop up. And you get to choose one of them. Uh, so cloak in the... Um, it affects hidden, which is her cloak, you know, stealth ability that she has. And it makes it last four seconds longer and you immediately exit combat. And you may also activate it uh, while mounted. And yes, there are mounts in the game. We'll go over that when we, you know, get into a game. And um, then we have collateral, which is the uh, effects weapon. As you can see under the name, it says weapon, hidden and weapon on the other one as well. Uh, and you deal 40% damage to all targets near your main target, which is, you know, awesome. AoE, great slash damage. Uh, one, one of my favorites, or not, it's, it's, a, it's a nice card. And then we have Decay, which is also, you know, uh, affects the weapons. Uh, you have a 12% chance to apply Zombie, reducing enemy healing by 100%, which is also very nice, you know, reduce healing. And uh, at the bottom here, at the uh, on the uh, of the cards, you can see some numbers. So the red one, which is plus twenty, plus eight, and plus twenty, are actually damage. So it boosts damage by twenty percent. I think that is what it means. I read that on like a you know, like a tutorial page or something. And the uh, cards have cooldowns. So you can see this one has twenty seconds, this one has forty seconds, and this one has twenty seconds. And that corresponds to when you die, the cards go on cooldown, and then, you know, they just straight away, you know, boop, you die, they go on cooldown, and they uh, start ticking down to when they are not off cooldown. So that's, I think that's just what they, what, what that is. Um, uh, which is, yeah, uh, mechanic. Um, and the nice so you know going in with this on cooldown you know you don't get the benefits from it uh, so if you you know the, the the cooldown is so long that you know you respawn and get into combat and collateral isn't up I don't have that 40% damage to all targets you know near my main target it's just something to keep in mind and then the uh, plus 100 plus 50 and plus 100 is just bonus uh, bonus health or you know it boosts your health by that much so not only do you get the uh, the special you know passive effect or whatever you also get some bonus damage and health from these cards and there are quite a lot of cards that you unlock from chests and uh, every character has their own uh, shit I don't want to go over all of that but that's just uh, a little bit of an overview uh, that um, that you have, uh, but I think that's pretty much it from, uh, from what, uh, what we can see. I mean, I guess we can like rare. Okay, that's how that works. Whatever. There's card crafting. You know, when you have duplicates, you can, uh, you know, turn in some duplicates and you know, hopefully get a, a better card or whatever. But. Let's just jump into a game and uh, see if we can, you know, find some players to play with. It actually isn't so hard, so stay tuned. All right then, ladies and gentlemen, we're in a game, so uh, let's start by choosing our card. Uh, time bomb, first mile mountain, plus 16% stacking slow, 16% slow targets. I think we're gonna go for the one. So. There are mounts in the game for mounts in the game for faster travel, obviously, which is pretty nice. So you just hold shift or press shift, and you'll uh, get that. And uh, we're playing Sky, which is so far my favorite character. She has a time bomb, which is her first ability, and uh, it is pretty nice. 
And that's the one. You just put down a uh, bomb that explodes after a short duration. Kill it! Son of a bitch, I died. First guy killed me. And then she has poison bolts, which is, you know, it's pretty much what it says. It shoots poison bolts. And hidden is a stealth. So, yeah. It's not too uh, weird. Um, but yeah, the objective here is to uh, capture the points. And then... Uh, Baby, ouch! I am the greatest. Was that? Boom, baby, dude. We just stopped this at 99. Alright, we leveled up so we can choose a new card. Oh, did I hit him with poison bolts? Is he gonna die? He's not gonna die. So I don't really wanna go in and choose. Ah, fuck it. I didn't die! Ah, oh, fuck, they got siege. I wanted to run in there and get it before they did, but... Ah, that sucks. I think we're gonna take that one. A little bit of healing. Yeah. So now they are gonna try and destroy our... Uh, Shit right here. Fuck. I'm dead. Right here. Heal, 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 heal. Yeah, that lion weight really is paying off. Sucked. Capture point has spawned. Always up for a ride. They're already there. Jesus fuck, dude. Yeah, fuck that, dude. Just put some beat down on them, though. Not much. Bit dirty. An enemy has been slain. Oh, they're Ally gonna get that siege slayer. too. An enemy siege engine has arrived. Yeah. But we have to destroy the siege. So, while killing fuckers is fun. Dude, would you leave me the fuck alone? Jesus Christ, dude. Yes. More poison damage. Hits the spot, healer. Your second gate is under attack. An enemy siege engine has been destroyed. An enemy Yeah, you just killed your best, dude. Let's do it. We need that help. Point spawning in ten seconds. 
And when you kill someone, they drop, you know, health packs or Point whatever. Guys, mount up. Point has Here we go. Yes. It's actually the first time I play this map. Group up. It's um, pretty cool. You bitch! Don't, Don't you kill life. me. You ah, son of a bitch. Place. Lucky little bitch. Oh, we're gonna be the luck. I was super low. And snuck on my ass. You know? Enemy double kill. Ooh, I like the kill. Uh, rust buckets. Alright. They're gonna get that one too. Oh, why did I do that? That was the wrong button. An ally has been slain. Didn't press that. That's too bad. Enemy slain. Ally slain. An enemy yeah. siege engine is okay. okay. Ah, you fucker! Your vault is under attack. Ah, uh, yeah, I An enemy know. Has been I know. Slain. Enemy slain. An enemy slain. Enemy has right. been destroyed. Point spawning in twenty seconds. That sounds pretty toy. fun. Alright, so we kind of only need like one siege and then, you know, go ham Point on their gates. Uh, so we can still pull this back. Capture point has spawned. We are lucky, but. Um, That's too bad. They're taking the point! <laughs> Fucking bitch, dude. Enemy killing spree. Why are you sitting there? Do some. Okay. Oh, they're gonna win now. Yeah, that that dude just sitting there is not helping much. Defend. Good game. Siege engine has arrived. That's too bad. An ally has been slain. You have been slain. So bitch. Healer. 
mean, they should just be running up the gate and kill that shit. Yeah, we've lost here. That sucks. That sucks. <laughs> oh well, shit happens. Alright, well, we got a chest. We can open that. Let's do that. Let's open that chest first. Here we go. Boom, let's see what we get. Some good. It's an epic. Oh, we got an epic, I guess. It's a new one. Slow enemy. Movement slow, not the last three seconds after leaving the initial area. Alright, cool. So you get five cards per chest. I guess, at least from those. I don't know the other wooden ones here. I don't know what that is, but... Whatever. So, yeah, that was a look at Paladin. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you all for watching. Thumb it up, subscribe. And if you want to see more, just leave a, a comment. Um, you know, it's kind of... A, it's a fun game. Uh, I might play more of it. So, yeah. Uh, thank you all. Don't forget to spread the virus. I'll see you next time. Bye.